One of the most important things to know before designing your irrigation system is what your flow rate is. This video will cover how you can find that out. All you're going to need is a bucket, a stopwatch and a garden tap. If your tap has any fittings attached, make sure you take them off before you start your flow test. Tap fittings will restrict the flow rate, giving us inaccurate test results. Next, get your timer ready and open the tap the full way before putting your bucket underneath. This gives us consistent full flow while we take our reading. I'm using a standard 9 litre bucket for this test, but you can use any size bucket that you have available. Just make sure that you know what the bucket's capacity is. Now that we've finished our bucket test, it's time to crunch the numbers. We know the size of our bucket, and we know how long it took to fill up. Using this information, we can calculate our approximate flow rate in litres per minute. To do that calculation, we use this formula. 60 divided by the time our bucket took to fill, multiplied by the size of the bucket. To allow for some pressure loss, as this test was an open flow test, we reduced the result by 20%. This 20% reduction isn't necessary if you test your flow rate using a pressure gauge. These flow rate test kits are available to hire from any Nutrien water branch. They allow you to perform the same test that we did earlier, but instead of an open flow rate, you can determine what your flow rate is at a designated pressure. To do this test, begin with the hose attached to the tap, then open the tap all the way. From here, slowly adjust the gate valve until the pressure gauge reads the desired pressure. Then continue as with the other test. Fill up the bucket and time how long it takes. This test will give us a more accurate reading than the open flow rate test. However, to get the most accurate flow rate, we can perform this same test, but instead of using a garden tap, we would connect our hose directly to a plumber's irrigation cut-in. If you can't access your cut-in, or you don't have one yet, the garden tap tests are still a good indication of what your flow rate is. Now that we know what our flow rate is, we can more accurately design an irrigation system. This will help to determine how many sprinklers you can have per station and how many solenoids will be on the whole system. For more information, call into your local Nutrient Water store or visit our website.